Greg Abbott continues to push for a border wall and border security, asking for additional allocations from the state legislature during the special session. Now, sheriffs from border counties join the governor in a briefing today. They express their concerns about a large number of dangerous high-speed chases, gang activity, and human trafficking in their areas. One sheriff said he doesn't have the budget or the resources to respond to activity near the border. A reporter pressed Governor Abbott on how much the wall would actually cost and what's the timeline? Do you think even in our lifetime that this wall will be built? Or so it's a cynical political ploy. Yeah, and it's, it's uh, well, it's a very uninformed question, but I need to give you the information because a lot is uh, if you would let me answer the question. That's what you say. A lot has transpired since the last time that we spoke. Okay. And what has transpired, the first step that had to be done uh, is we needed to hire a program manager. Uh, and uh, the Texas Facilities Commission has already begun that process, as well as the Texas Facilities Commission has already received bids for building the wall. Uh, the cost is coming in lower than what we thought. The, the speed at which the wall will be able to be built uh, is coming along faster than what we thought. Now, Governor Abbott recently authorized a $250 million transfer for the project to identify where fencing needs to go and to start building.